Tom has lost 180 pounds, and by the looks of it, you only got about 200 more to go. Todd, <laughs> uh, you kind of look like an Abercrombie and Fish model after they had kept off the job for doing heroin. <laughs> First time I came here to comedy, uh, Todd told me I'm not going to do a set. And after coming to numerous comedy nights, he has not lied to me yet. <laughs> Todd's the type of guy that uh, crosses swords in a three-way and then winks at the other dude. <laughs> when Todd transfers funds, he just switches pockets. Give <laughs> it up for your roast master, Ryan Graham. Woo! Voted most punchable face of 2017. You might know Ryan from his extensive modeling work on Easter Island. <laughs> Man, you fat fucking quagmire looking fuck. <laughs> Ryan has to spin to a cup almost as often as the woman that kissed him. <laughs> I, I feel bad about this. One time I told Sean Weiss to quit comedy. And well, I felt multiple times. Multiple times. And I felt really bad that he didn't listen to me. <laughs> You do a joke about roofies, right? You do a joke about roofies. Maybe if someone ripped your beard off your chin and put it on your head, you might not have to roofie a woman for a while. John, you look like you pee roofing all. <laughs> More like Jake McBowell, because his comedy's like poop. <laughs> Got him. Got him. Woo. Wow. Woo. Jake has been clean and sober just as long as it's been since Chris last masturbated. <laughs> Chris Coffin's in the house, which is funny, because up to a few years ago, he's, he was always in the fucking house. <laughs> As the world record to jerking off to po uh, Pornhub in the most in one day in the I'm not gay, just curious section. <laughs> Chris Coffin. Uh, oh, God. I have a whole lot. I bet Chris Kaufman's ponytail smells like a wet ferret cage. <laughs> With those Thomas Jefferson looking glasses, you should be able to read the directions on the bottle of shampoo that say, use daily. <laughs> Robert Wallace is as fun as a barrel of monkeys. Sorry, did I say monkeys? I meant meth. <laughs> Dude, Robert pulls out wads of cash and doesn't explain where, uh, what he does. All I know is cops are looking for a white male prostitute. <laughs> you handsome Bob Saget looking fuck. Uh, you look like Eli Manning fucked a Slim Jim. He's so sheltered that he thought ketamine was a Pokemon. <laughs> No, honestly, Ben's a really sweet kid. He's so sweet, he shits puppies. <laughs> He's so innocent that he turns porn off after the kissing part. <laughs> yeah, Levi just came from the set of the new Pirates movie. <laughs> <laughs> Levi looks like a hypnotist who really, really wants me to remember, remember the 5th of November, the gunpowder treason and plot. For no other reason than the gunpowder treason should ever be forgotten. Stay out of my head! I don't know Levi, but I'm, I'm guessing he was here for poetry slam night. <laughs> <laughs> Jeff Styles is here. Uh, they say you only roast the ones you love, so I'm not, I didn't write anything about Jeff Styles. <laughs> <laughs> I opened up a Laffy Taffy one time and I saw one of Jeff's jokes. It was right <laughs> <laughs> you know, Jeff, I really wanted to get up here and embarrass you. But you already got up here and did that yourself. <laughs> it doesn't matter what I say about Jeff, he's not gonna remember it tomorrow. <laughs> Give it up for Tom Galloway, everybody. Yeah! Tom, if you're here, who's playing bass in your My Chemical Romance cover band? <laughs> Tom looks like Steven Spielberg fucked Alf. <laughs> You're everything that I strive not to be. Fat, lazy, broke, and gay. <laughs> Tom's developing a lazy eye to match his personality. <laughs> you look like you smoke McDonald's. <laughs> Tom looks 
like he would gladly pay you Tuesday for a hamburger today. <laughs> That's Popeye, Wimpy, anybody? You look like a mugshot waiting to happen. <laughs> Always open for uh, Tim Meadows and uh, wh who was the guy on Wednesday? Pardo? Jimmy Pardo. Jimmy Pardo. Uh, which just goes to show that literally anyone can do comedy. <laughs> <laughs> Happy birthday, dear douchebag. How do we? Happy birthday to you. Thank you for coming.